Hi everybody, welcome back to Fragmental. I hope you're doing well. Here I am again, and today I'm reviewing Leighton from Parfums de Mali. There's also a giveaway, so if you want a chance to win, stay tuned to FM. Before I get into the review, I just want to give a shout out to the sponsor of this video, the fantastic Fragrance Splits. Fragrance Splits are based in the US. They offer 8 mil and 2 mil decants of popular niche and designer fragrances. They come in these really funky little travel sprayers. You may have seen ones like this before. They just pop up. Protect your fragrance really well. Perfect for taking away on holiday. I'm going to be going away for a few weeks this summer, so I'll be definitely taking one of these with me. Unfortunately, at this moment in time, Fragrance Split aren't shipping to the UK, but UK viewers, don't worry, you are still eligible for the giveaway in this video. So head on over to Fragrance Split's website, I'll leave a link in the description down below. See if anything they offer tickles your fancy, and take a bit of time to read their story and you'll realise that when you buy from them you're actually supporting a really good cause. If you do like something that they offer and you want to make a purchase, please use my discount code FM20 and you'll get 20% off your first purchase. Okay, let's talk about Leighton. Leighton is an offering from the house of Parfums de Mali. It's an oriental floral, and we'll take a quick look at the notes. In the top, there's bergamot, lavender, apple, and mandarin. In the mid, violet, jasmine, and geranium. In the base, guyacwood, patchouli, cardamom, vanilla, and pepper. Let me start off by saying that I think Leighton is a gorgeous fragrance. I'm a big fan of Parfums de Mali. I've tried quite a few from the house now and I've been impressed with all of them. You find that for niche, they're pretty affordable. They have great performance. They're very wearable. A lot of them are very crowd pleasing. They're not too challenging or too daring. And I find that their fragrances all tend to be quite thick and rich and full bodied, which is uh, what helps them to have this fantastic performance. Even though the top layer of Leighton is comprised of fruits and citruses, to me, they don't provide the prominent accord. I get more spices, so warm spices. I pick up on a lot of cardamom, and I even get a bit of nutmeg. I don't think nutmeg is a listed note, but I get a hint of it in there. I also get a subtle hint of the apple, which you tend to find in quite a few Parfums de Mali's fragrances. Ojan has a big apple accord going on in there. The apple here is nowhere near as boosted as in Ojan, but you get a nice blend of warm spices and some subtle fruits. I also get a coffee accord in Leighton. It's not a listed note, it's just something that I pick up on, and it actually reminds me, in the opening anyway, of by Killian's Intoxicated. So with Intoxicated, it opens with this really loud cardamom blast and you get this quite distinctive, really nice coffee accord. For me, Leighton has a similar vibe going on. So it does remind me of Intoxicated, particularly in the opening, but I find Leighton to be not quite as loud, smoother and a bit more refined. As Leighton dries down, the top notes do fade, but to me they seem to remain throughout the life of the fragrance. What we're left with in the latter stages is this lovely, smooth, creamy sandalwood and sweet vanilla scent punctuated by those lovely warm spicy notes. As with most Parfums de Mali's fragrances, I find Leighton to be smooth, deep, rich, full bodied and quite luxurious. It's really easy to wear and it's crowd pleasing. Performance is fantastic. For me, this is a beast. I'm getting three to four hours of decent projection and then it'll stay as a strong skin scent for 10 hours plus. I actually sprayed this at the start of a shift and then eight or nine hours later, a colleague walked past me and said that they could still smell what I was wearing quite strongly. So it really is a great performer. In terms of versatility, this is unisex. In my opinion, it would work for any occasion and pretty much any time of year. I just would avoid wearing it in high heat situations. So if you're gonna wear it in the summer, maybe on cooler summer evenings, but it would work really well in the autumn, winter or spring. Giveaway time. As with all fragrance split giveaways, Ways, there will be two winners, one based in the US, one outside of the US, and you can win this lovely travel sprayer of the gorgeous Leighton. To be in it to win it, this is what you've got to do. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, give this video a like, go over to my Instagram account, follow me there, and also go to Fragrance Split's Facebook page and give them a like. In the comments below this video, let me know whether you're based in the US or outside of the US. Also, let me know what your Instagram name is because I will be announcing the winner on Instagram in a week's time. That's it, job done. I hope you enjoyed this video and you found it useful. If you've tried Leighton, please let me know what you think of it. Leave some comments down below. I'd love to hear what you've got to say. Please like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell. 
to enable notifications. And until next time, keep tuning into FM and keep smelling good.